can probably see, we are no longer in the south of France. We're driving towards the Alps. So keep watching and we'll show you where we're going. Hopefully some more beautiful scenery on the way. Swept the back and swallowed by the way. So explain where we are. We are five kilometers from our campsite in a place called Favage. Favage. We can't get in. We can't get in in any direction because there's Through a the event and the road is short. Yeah, the police are over there. Although he's, I'm sure he's about to open the road. He just moved to Cones. He told us it reopens at four. It's half two, so we just sat waiting to see what's going to happen. So he just moved his cones, look. Yeah, he's whistling everyone through. Oh. Right, we're going to go. We just made lunch. No, man, we've waited ten minutes. Never mind. Let's eat lunch and then go. So after our little stop off at Lidl, uh, we've just realised the road's now open, so we can go and check in, hopefully, to the... What's that? Oh, the drawer. The drawer's open. Fucking mistake every time. Watch your head. Smashed it twice already. So we're staying in a campsite in a place called Dusard. We think. <laughs> uh, is this it? No. Different one straight on. Cool. Right, we'll turn you off and catch you later. We've arrived at our destination at Lake Annecy, haven't we? We have. And this is the pool complex, we'll show you again while we're here, we can do it today. It's got slides, pool for kiddies, all the sites here are full. It's um, obviously very popular time of the year to come here. We were very fortunate, there's a play area and an old sports court. There's a bar, restaurant, down there's a bar, restaurant, shop, gym as well. And it's only just uh, the lakes on the side of those trees just over there. We haven't been answered yet, we're going to go down shortly, we're aren't we? Minute, yeah. Yeah. We'll probably drink first in the bar, just yeah. test the local beer. Just try it out, it should be social, yeah. obviously. Good news, they appear to have local beer here from the Mont Blanc, which we're the side of Mont Blanc, aren't we? Yes, we are. Ooh, so, yeah, Mont Blanc, Bleu or Riz. I'll try those. Excellent. Just to make sure we didn't go off piste, stayed local. Brasserie de Mont Blanc, this is a red beer, La Rousse, it's very nice. Uh, it is 6.5%, so quite strong. World winning award, world beer awards. Um, it won an award and it's extremely nice indeed. Uh, yeah, definitely recommend this one. Comes in a posh fancy glass as well. That was chilled for me by the lady. What have you got to drink? Gin and tonic. Caroline's found a gin in France, first time. Yeah, and uh, hopefully the tonic will stop the mosquitoes from eating me alive every night. <laughs> Just to add on this beer, obviously it's Mont Blanc, but they actually use water from, yeah, my fingers gone, water from the glaciers of Mont Blanc to make the beer, which makes it even spe more special. Hello. Hello. We've arrived at Lake Annecy, as you've probably just seen for our intro video of arrival. Um, we travelled this morning from the south of France. It took us about four hours, didn't it? Uh, yeah, four hours. It's slight like detour because of the... Closed road? Yeah, and we stopped, bike race. Yeah, we stopped for fuel and we stopped for uh, supermarket stuff as well because it's Sunday in France. And it's only, supermarkets generally only open in the morning in France on a Sunday. So. We thought we were being smart and stopped up as soon as we left. And we're like, that's it, we'll just power through, we'll get straight there. Then we were about an hour in and the ad blue light came on. So we had to stop again and get some ad blue. But anyway, that was fine. Easy to do. The French petrol stations have them just like ours. So now we're just we just had a quick drink in the bar and we're just going to go off and explore the lake. We're going to take the bikes down to the lake. It's, a, it's about a 20 minute walk. So we take the bikes down and we'll be there down there in a second. So we'll uh, take you along with us and see what we can do. Hopefully going for a swim if it's not too busy in the lake. There's a cycle path down there. Wow. This is absolutely stunning. This is what I bought a camper van for. From the sea to the mountain. Lake. Yeah. Enjoying it? Yeah. Nice. Very cool. Great, very, um, 
beach like area, isn't it? For yeah. swimming and stuff. Yeah. You've got Perfect. The, uh, pontoons that you can swim out to and jump Is in there? from. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, I wish I brought my kayak. <laughs> Maybe better hire one. Maybe Caroline have a go on a paddleboard here. Who knows? Oh, Caroline, she's sat over there. Just straight ahead. You can see it. She's sat just there on the pier. Jetty thing. Oh. oh my goodness, this is bliss. Yesterday in the sea on the south coast, today in the lake in the Alps. Pre motor home, we've never done anything like this. <laughs> Not on ho one holiday, anyway. Tonight's barbecue is goat's cheese and tomato. Was it? Yeah, roasted well, barbecue, yeah. goat's cheese and tomato. I'll tell you, it was the barbecue. That's the table, some beer. And here, Caroline's toast is just being cooked. We have a Toulouse sausage. Look at that. Looks fantastic. That's tonight's dinner. Good morning. Good morning from Lake Annecy. It is just about morning, though, it is morning. Probably about three o'clock in the afternoon by the time we get ourselves organised. <laughs> it's Monday and it's our first full day here at Lake Annecy, so we decided, typical Fantastic Adventures, we'll go for a hike. It's only 30 degrees today, so you know, we tried to go before it gets too warm. It's supposed to be about 27, 28. But around here, have you got a map? There's a map. Around here, this area, there's loads of good hikes and they give you a map in Annecy or where we are, uh, where the starting points are. So we pick one, thank you, there's a map. And this basically has got loads of different routes on. We're going to take a relatively easy one today. There are a couple of harder ones, but someone hasn't brought our walking shoes. So obviously we'll take the easier one today. But this one hopefully takes in a waterfall. And I've got the camera with me, hopefully the drone as well. Spectacular but, scenery. Absolutely. Here, well, you can probably see it? in the background. Yeah, it's amazing. With, you're, you're using the hay bale to film you on at the moment. So you can see us from a hay bale behind us see some more. So I walk down to the starting point of this, this uh, hike. It's about 20 minutes walk from the campsite. Do the hike, and then I'm going to come back and then have some lunch and go into Dussard. You think that's how you say it? Um, I think that's right. And have a look around and see what there is there as well. So we'll take you with this and see how we get on. Back to traditional methods with a map. Where is the you are here? <laughs> <laughs> We're over here somewhere. So Hard to start. <laughs> Hopefully, you can see those paragliders just there. Oh, I'm not sure what they are. Yeah, paragliders, I think. Just there's loads of them in the mountains. It's fantastic. Uh, I'm going to try and get them a bit closer shot of them if possible. Nothing like walking in the midday sun. Oh, what a beautiful view. We're only halfway up as well. Nice view, isn't it, so Amazing. far? Amazing, yeah. There's a little water stream going over. I presume this is part of the waterfall we're about to see. But we're going to get this massive hill first. So we get on. Glad we picked the easy route. Yeah. Oh my god. Dead easy. We're expecting to make a flat path with for bus chairs. Oh. Oh. It's definitely not one for uh, bus chairs. No. And we are doing it in the midday haunt, midday sun, heat. Can't yeah. even speak. It's only June. Anyway, a little bit higher. Then we go off to the right down there. And hopefully find the waterfall. We don't pass out before him. We have got water, we've got walking gear We've got water, snacks, hats, sun Everything's cream. sensible. We are equipped as best we can be. Yeah. But it's bleeding warm. Sweaty. We made it! Oof. It's very pretty. Beautiful. You can see, obviously it's in summer. You can see, wow, how high it could have come lashing down there. You see all the rocks covered in green there. Yeah, look how clear the water is. Oh wow.
Remember when we went to Greece? Yeah. And we turned it walked all the way to that waterfall and there was no water in it. Because it yeah. was summer. Yeah, we used some water here. I know, that's true. I did that in flip flops as well. See, I've learned my lesson now. When death walks with Ian Brown, I put shoes on. Trainers. Fantastic. Sorry about the sweat. It's not cold. It's just not as heat as the other one was. The other one was too warm, that one in the south of France. That's not bad. That's like a bath. That's how I like my swimming. Normandy was cooler than this. This one's sort of in the middle. Isn't it? <laughs> You're in now. You're okay. Look at the mountains drop. This is okay. the best view, isn't it, by far? Yeah. Of any of the pools. It's a slide. I'm going to test the slides out again, like last time, like children, like children. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Come then. Oh. <laughs> Go. So we cycled down 10 minutes from the campsite on the bikes right to the port. Here we are on the banks of Lock An Lake Annecy. Lock, gosh, uh, got where uh. I am. I'm going to pretend I know some local information now and I'm not just reading it from a board. But basically, um, there used to be two lakes here. The Pretty Lake, the Little Lake, and the Grand Lake, the Big Lake. This is the Little Lake, the Big Lake is the other end. And basically, after some movements of tectonic plates, the two merged together and now you have Lake Annecy as one lake. This is boring. Tell about the frog story. Um, so basically, each spring, um, residents help frogs cross the road so they don't get squished on the way to their uh, breeding ground. That's cool. And let's talk about the mountains. Oh yeah, mountains, sorry. So, Dent de Lanfon is the tallest. That's that big. That one there. Oh, you okay. one there, I reckon, yeah. Yeah, I can be right. And then to That's the right impressive. of that one is Lanfone. That one? At 1,795 metres. What's the biggest one? That, the biggest one is Dents de Lanfone. How tall, 1, sorry? 1,824 nice. metres. That's interesting local knowledge. I'm very impressed. Yeah. That's what I'm here for. How good is that? Super quick. 10 minutes from the campsite. They have actual bike parking, velo parking. We're parked in the bike park, official parking. Uh, it says it's not surveillance, no cameras, but it's plenty. Oh, there is actually, look. It's one right above the bike. Yeah. Hopefully that'll put everybody off. Okay, I think, does this place win for views? Yeah, definitely. I mean, you don't even need me to stand it. In fact, I should probably just like back out of the shot so you can see it, but no, no, give me, give me, give me. Um, yeah, it's just amazing. Just so beautiful. We've just been sat here for like 15 minutes, just soaking it all in. It's just amazing. Lovely cool breeze now. Yeah, it's much, much better here. I can actually breathe. 26 degrees. 26, is it? 26. It's getting hotter though, isn't it? Apparently, yeah, it's going to be 31 tomorrow, 32 uh, the day after. As long as you keep the breeze, I can manage that. Lake Annecy, highly recommended. If, you can, if, the, if the camera's picking the colour of the water, it's like turquoise. It is so blue. So nice. Tried to drop the camera in. That would be bad. You'd have no footage and you'd be watching this now. <laughs> so it just feels on our sofa at home on the phone going, yeah, really sorry we lost all our footage, but I uh, <laughs> promise we had a nice time. Cool. Okay, we're going to go explore and see if we can find a pharmacy because we've got bites from the south of France. Show you're going to need a pharmacy. Oh, oh yeah, I've got some my leg as well. Look. Oh man. Pharmacy, pharmacy or tonic water. Yeah, quinine in, and obviously gin some gin to go in the tonic water. <laughs> On a lovely holiday. Tonight's tea, obviously, another barbecue. Caroline has this time though. We have Caroline helped. We have. Veggie burger, but also roasted potatoes that we've done in garlic, oil, pepper, salt, and some herbs. Really nice, aren't they? Mm.
So <clears throat> all the other journeys we've done on this cycle path have been that way towards Dusart. Cycle path. And Boat de Lac. Um, so today we are going left up to... Spin round. This way to Annecy. This way. Hopefully it goes pretty much all the way on the lake, doesn't it? Cycle yeah, it path. does, yeah. Hoping it's flat all the way Yeah, around. this is a very it's steep hill on here. Google. I'm hoping it's down, maybe, down the way. <laughs> Otherwise, I think maybe we should do it in reverse. It's so just down. See how we get on. But, um, Very busy, yeah. this cycle path. You can see people going past every two seconds. Yeah, so. um, and literally every form of transport. I tell you what, there's a lot of here with these... Um, it's like one wheel with... I don't know what you call it. with Hoverboard. Wheel, like a hoverboard. But people are in, like, full gear. It's like, one came towards us last night so fast. It's like some out of Robocop, but it's pretty scary, actually. <laughs> it looks cool. Full helmet and goggles on. Um, I want to go. But yeah, rollerblades, all sorts, literally every every form of transport. We're in Annecy. That was a lovely cycle. It's just so easy, wasn't it? One of the best, I think. The scenery is just amazing all the way along. Yeah, every time you turn around, every time you see the lake or the houses, it's just spectacular. There's too much to film, so we just film a whole video of scenery, which is, you need to experience it yourself. But hopefully you get the gist of it. Power boat going off up there, paddle boarders, in separate areas, kayakers. I think we need to live here. I think we do. I was thinking exactly the same. Oh, look. <laughs> That's amazing. So blue. Oh, we've got them in like car park looks like in there. Uh... Oh, for your bike? Uh, no, well, no, for your um, you know, dam. Oh, underground? underground. We're, We're in Annecy, aren't we? Uh, yeah. Annecy, Annecy up there. We, um, this is the uh, like town hall? City hall. City yeah. hall. It's absolutely beautiful. We're coming back tomorrow, but we're actually going to get the bus. Um, it's taken us, what, about an hour and 40 minutes to cycle here? Yeah. We stopped a few leave. times. You know, every time there's something good to look at, we stop. Yeah. So. You could probably do it an hour. Uh, if you've got a fast bike, an hour. Yeah. And these bikes probably an hour and 20, something like that, maybe an hour and yeah. 10, 15. I mean, it's warm, so yeah. we just tried to take it easy and enjoy the scenery, really, which was the point yeah. wasn't it, of today. Yeah, we'll go and see you here tomorrow on the bus. Oh, we've just been climbing for about half an hour. Absolutely exhausted. We're just about to hit the downhill. Oh my goodness, this feels good. Caroline's behind me. Hopefully you can see her. Oh. Oh my goodness. Downhill, here we come. Fantastic. We stopped. Caroline's just been over the crap. A couple of beers, water and hamburger. I am very excited. I We're almost back. <laughs> We're almost back, but we stopped just about 20 minutes from the, uh, from the campsite to have some lunch. Mm. Let's eat. Good morning. Morning. Where are we going? Annecy, on the bus. Bus, first time for us. We're just walking to the bus stop, which is not far, is it? Uh, we hope not, 0.8 of a mile, it said, so okay. watch your back. <laughs> um, so we're just walking to the bus stop, we think we know where it is, but there looks to be a, lo a local lady in front of us, so we... We're following that little lo local lady there, she knows where she's going, we're sure of it. We 
made it. We survived the bus with our school French to ask for two return tickets. And we're just outside the um, town hall over there. Oh yeah, just there. That's right, fantastic. So let's go and uh, bus. see what it's doing. Bus to Zeta Bush, it's told you when to get off and the driver's only friendly. Loving public transport in France. Yes, seven euros return cool. each. So we're in Annecy and coincidentally it's the international annual Annecy Animation Film Festival. So loads and loads of animation films, there's loads of people here from channels like BBC, Sky, all Pixar, all loads of people, it's, it's round, there's loads of festivals and events going on. We've not come for that specifically but it's really cool, there's a nice atmosphere and behind us you can probably see there's loads of like uh, check-in areas, we've been to the shop, had a look round and um, there's just animation stuff everywhere. It's really cool. I love to be able to do animation and learn how to do it. So I might try. I've got some software, so when I get back, you never know. Might fantastic an adventures in cartoons. Yeah, animated fantastic adventures. Comfy, are we? Yeah. A little rest here. A little sunbathe. <laughs> no. In between walks. There's uh, so much uh, to see and do, isn't there? Yeah. It's a city and it's a lake. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't realise it was a city. It's huge. It's like something from Disneyland, isn't it? It's really cool, like literally the whole place is like something from... Oh, this is a bit you're on about. Mm -hmm. I see. I see. Oh, I'm sorry, but you're not going to get a boat through there, are you? Well, I didn't know how low the bridges were, did I? Can I wait to take a boat tour around these cars? I just asked. <laughs> on a little tiny boat for the midget people. <laughs> Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I didn't know how low the bridges were and I just asked the lady in the tourist information if there was such a thing and she just looked at me like I'd said the most stupid thing ever. Which I understand maybe I did now, but... I think you were reading the brochure somewhere else. Venice, yes. Yeah. <laughs> so that is Annecy Castle. Sorry, I'm just having a drink. Annecy Castle. Um, it was um, where the Counts of somewhere lived in the 15th 16th century and then um, there's military barracks till 1947 they've got some four air raid shelters dug underneath it turned into a museum in 1950 yeah now it's, it's a museum place. of art and national uh, natural history oh. etc cool we didn't go in we just <laughs> wanted to see the, what it looked like we just wanted to walk up a hill in the midday sun as usual <laughs> Lunchtime. She must have known you wanted to sit near the air conditioning. Right by the door Happy? Yes. Our lunch we're just gonna have a wander around and um, probably walk down to the lake and the harbour where we were yesterday we cycle through just to have a bit more of a look around but what a be what a beautiful place just uh, amazing the old town is just spectacular it really is but mini Venice mini Venice well not that no we haven't been to Venice roads. yet all right, all right. Fantastic adventures are on Lover's Bridge? <laughs> Romantic Bridge. Is it Lover's Bridge? Lover's Bridge, somewhere anyway, like that. It's a little bridge, very popular. Everyone's here taking pictures, cracking background and scenery. So, yep, yeah, very popular.
very nice indeed. We'll give you a quick look around. Oh, thanks. Oh, oh. My luck is it in. It works. <laughs> Two glasses of wine for lunch. That's all you need. Back again. Wow, we're roasting. That's a leg up for the boss. Sweaty. Hopefully. I was filming me when I'm sweating. <laughs> We've been shopping and uh, we were last minute of the till, weren't we? We legged it with a minute to spare. Well, so. we, the lady told us we could get a discount, you see, on the things that we'd bought. So she offered to refund and then redo it again. And there was a big debacle. And he forgot to put his card in the machine. And then to call us over the tannoy. Oh. <laughs> so now we had to run for the bus. We made it, we got our stuff and we got a load of discount as well. So it saved about so 60, bad. 70 euros. Yeah. We did, really good. but we'd have to run. Yeah. Um, I head back now and chill out. Go out for dinner tonight at the restaurant. So we'll again do this out one day. So we're back from uh, Annecy. We had a nice bush ride back. Uh, it was a lovely place, one of the nicest places I've ever been to in my life. Oh, wow, what a testament. Yeah. Definitely like to return here, especially when it's winter sports and it's snowing because it looks absolutely fantastic. It's so alpine, we had a fantastic lunch, lovely walk around. The last night here tonight, we're a bit sad. We are a bit. Um, but we're moving on tomorrow to one more campsite for one night before we head back to the UK. So yeah, we're going to go and have dinner now in the restaurant on site, which looks nice. Uh, we've booked a table for eight, it's two minutes to, so we'll turn the camera off now and we might, <laughs> take, you, might take you with us for a quick look at what we're having for dinner. But otherwise, we'll catch you tomorrow when we're back on the road. Love it here. Annecy is stunning. Definitely recommend it. Highly recommend 100%. it. 100%. Yeah. So just literally driven out of the campsite and uh, yeah, very sad to be leaving this place. Um, but we're going to somewhere else before we head home, so we'll take you with us and uh, see how we get on. Oh, there's a junction. <laughs> Don't pay attention. Yeah, probably focus on the driving for a bit now. Yeah, I'm, I'm, uh, I'll be talking for most of the day because it feels like we're going home now. Well, we are going home, we're heading home. Eventually, so, yeah. Yeah, I'm so, I'll be most talking. So I'll let you know morning. how we get on. We're going to go and try and see some more beautiful scenery heading more towards Switzerland. So we'll, uh, we'll see how we get on. <laughs> 